simple lecture i am going to discuss what how to create a windows form application from a command line so let's see all the steps so first here i am going to open visual studio 2020 so there we need to create the project so console application command line application that creating the project okay so going to select so here you can see this option console application console app and .NET from back a project for creating command line application so click on this next and create okay there I did the mistakes no need to worry about that so here we need to give the meaningful name so let's give here the name rename so giving here form one so if you change here you need to change there also now thereafter the next uh, thing is this namespace that required so this namespace that required so that remove that paste so now I'm going getting the error message on this one so what we need you need to do so go to the reference here add reference then assemblies then you can search here form so you can uh, see here this is now system windows form click on this ok so form is added inside the reference now like that if uh, here or uh, drawing it's uh, showing or uh, there is no any problem with the drawings but uh, here if any error occur so let's uh, search here form then uh, systems ok let's write here drawings system dot drawings so if there there is the problems then you need to add this system dot drawing namespace now after doing this one so here we need to inherit so form one that inherit the form okay after that the next is okay this one we need to use this class so here class that inherit so in place of this one going to paste that okay so now you can see public class form1 that inherit form and after doing this one the next uh, thing here you need to add this to inside two lines of codes inside the okay wait few second copy and paste inside the main save that now you can see there is no any problem with the code so now first here let's run and check the output so after that I will explain this code here so first that open command line then you can see windows form that created so click on this submit then open one new box that open hello world it's a display now thereafter I'm going to explain this code so you know how to add the or uh, this if that there is the problem with the namespace you can add the namespace by clicking the references after that now you can see so uh, there I have taken public button class object name button and this button creating the object inside the form 1 so form, form 1 is the class and form 1 is the constructor so creating the object button with equal to new button and there setting the size height width and location and this is text and if uh, 
or the right to the click okay this control that add so this button that add on the form after that button click event that fire then so the control comes to this button one dot click so there that comes so if you click then control comes to this point then there is the message box that display inside the message box hello world okay so if you run or debug the code then first control comes to main method application enable visual style after that application that call run and new form one so that starts searching form one constructor so control comes to this point then button object created then button size location then text then after all this doing the add on the form and after that uh, button when click event that fire fire then button one dot click that uh, start searching here that font that display hello world after that that back to this position then out from the main method so this is how we can add the sorry we can here this is how we can add create a windows form application by using command line so it's too easy so this steps you need to follow and this course then you can easily do that so i hope guys this video is the helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you